Captain's log, stardate 48650.1. We are en route to the K11 anomaly, a gravitational singularity in its earliest stages of formation. We have on board Dr. Aris Thorne of the Daystrom Institute, a physicist whose work has long been confined to the fringes of cosmological theory. Dr. Thorne posits a theory as audacious as any I have ever encountered, that black holes are not an end, but a beginning, that with every stellar collapse, a new universe, with its own big bang, is born. Starfleet has always tasked us with charting the unknown, but Dr. Thorne seeks to chart creation itself. The risks are considerable, but the chance to answer a question that has defined existence is a mission I cannot, in good conscience, ignore. Trinity of every great leap forward, Captain. Copernicus, Galileo, Zephram Cochran, they were all unsubstantiated until they weren't. Indeed. You've requested the use of this vessel for a mission to the K-11 anomaly. Starfleet has approved it, pending my own assessment of the risks. So please, Doctor, convince me. For centuries, we've viewed black holes as the universe's cemetery. The end of the line. A final, inescapable punctuation mark on matter, energy, time itself.